hey, it's it's the it's the old like if you save the universe thing, you can get a pass, <laughs> right? You could behead people, you can commit genocide, you can murder anybody, you can do as long the ends do justify the means in Star Trek. As long as you save that universe, if it turns out you were wrong, then you go to prison. Uh, Kirk, Kirk and his and his friends they st they stole the Enterprise and they blew it up, um, but you know they saved the whales. They, they saved the Earth from uh, uh, a, a giant piece of sausage in space that was going to tear up the planet. Trying to talk to whales, they happened to be there, and so they they said, ah, you know what? In light of the circumstances, no, there were no beheadings in Star Trek Three: The Search for Spock. Did did we ever find out what the fuck that thing wanted to talk to whales about so no, badly? No, it's a, it's a private thing. They've been communicating <laughs> for eons, Rich, across vast distances of space. That's how whales are so... Are they, are they a whale race? Are like, are like whales extraterrestrials? It's beyond human comprehension. That's the magic of Star Trek. There are things like that in Star Trek. We don't need to know. Also, the giant sausage in space may have been Picard's mother. 